Army First Sergeant John Hatley is officially back at home in Grosbeck today. Yesterday morning, he walked out of the federal prison in Fort Leavenworth, Kansas, where he immediately married his fiance. This is video from United American Patriots of Hatley being greeted by family members today in his hometown. A military jury convicted Hatley of killing four Iraqi detainees in April of 2009 and sentenced him to life behind bars with the possibility of parole. Prosecutors said Hatley's unit took the men into custody after a firefight in 2007 near Baghdad. Hatley has maintained his innocence from the beginning. He says investigators never found any bodies or signs of a shooting. He claims prosecutors based their case on the testimony of a few soldiers who had already taken plea deals and takes issue with the military court system. But today, he says he loves Texas and won't be going anywhere any, anytime soon. I mean, the fact that all of this is so familiar, you know, because I know, I know all these back roads, I know this area, you know, I grew up in here, and then just to be able to see all the trees and, and uh, the drive down here, and then like last night, being able to look out and actually see the stars, you know, for, you know, for the first time in over a decade, it, it's just, it's amazing, you know, when you, like I said, when you spent 20 years living in the woods, you know, as an infantryman, and then all of that stripped away from you. You, you realize just how valuable and how you know those those small things are you realize just just how much you actually lose Hatley says he was most excited to finally see his parents who haven't been able to see him for the past five years because of health conditions. He says he's thankful for all of his hometown supporters who have a special rally planned for Monday night at Grosbeck High School.